Griffin, thank you. Well, even if you're not planning on traveling much this year, you can still get to Greece this weekend. <laughs> and if you don't know, now you know because it's the big Greek festival and it's happening right now in downtown yes. Greenville. That is where we find Carol Clark and Nigel Robertson. You all look real comfortable out there. We are, we are. And, you know, we've talked about food, we've talked about music, but now we're going to talk about Greek dancing. And you so, were going to dance? Yeah, so I'm going to start doing some stretches here, and then uh, <laughs> I'm going to show you some good Greek dancing. No, I'm not. Yeah. No, I'm not. But, but, you know, <laughs> dancing is a huge part of the Greek culture. Yes, it is. In fact, in the Greek culture, you can usually figure out what region of the country someone is from by how they dance. For example, in the Aegean Islands, the dances are quick and they're light and usually performed by couples, not so much line dancing. In Epirus, the dancing is slower, but no matter where you are from, dancing is an important part of the culture. From age two all the way to our seniors in high school have been practicing for the last few months. They're so excited to be able to give you a little bit of a piece of the Greek culture. You'll see them dancing on the hour during the festival and um, at five o'clock every day we do something really special. It's our parade of dancers. It's the one time that you can see all the age groups, all the dancers in one place at the same time. And they just finished today's parade. And Tori, who you just heard from, started Greek dancing at age two and danced through high school. And now she comes back and she teaches dance. So are you all warmed up? Yeah, but uh, I think what we're showing here on the television is much better than what I can do. <laughs> so if you want to come down and see it yourself live, here's all the information you need to know. The festival goes until 9 tonight, tomorrow, 11 a.m. to 9 p.m. And on Sunday, 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. Admission is $3 and all proceeds go to charity again. If you'd like to check out the menus, the dance, the music performance times, and how to tour the church, which is really yeah, beautiful. beautiful, check out our link on WYFF4.com. And coming up, we have more food. food. <laughs> Back to you.